Shenzhen Baoan International Airport is an international airport that serves the city of Shenzhen in Guangdong Province, South Central China. It's situated on the east bank of the Pearl River near Huantian and Fuyong villages in Baoan District and is about 32 kilometers northwest of the city center. The airport is a hub for several airlines including Shenzhen Airlines, Shenzhen Donghai Airlines, SF Airlines, China Southern Airlines, and Hainan Airlines. It also serves as an Asian Pacific cargo hub for UPS Airlines. In the 2010s, the airport underwent significant expansions, which included the opening of a second runway in 2011 and a new terminal in 2013. It's one of the three largest airports serving the Pearl River Delta, the other two being Hong Kong International Airport and Guangzhou Baiyun International Airport. Shenzhen Baoan International Airport also offers direct ferry routes to Hong Kong International Airport, allowing passengers to transit without going through immigration and custom checks. Tencent Helix Complex in Shenzhen this structure is set to serve as the global headquarters for Tencent, a leading tech company known for developing the multifaceted WeChat app. The Tencent Helix Complex is expected to be a centerpiece in the upcoming financial district in Qianhai Bay. The complex consists of four towers of varying heights, arranged around landscape terraces and flanked by five teardrop-shaped wings. The tallest tower will measure 153 meters, just surpassing the height to be considered a skyscraper. The total area of the complex is expected to be almost twice as large as Apple Park, the Apple headquarters in California. The design of the Tencent Helix complex symbolizes the company's rapid growth. The building's dynamic spiraling movement is anchored at its core with the Vortex Incubator, a flexible gathering place that connects the four office towers. The first city proposed for Mars is Nuwa, a part of an ambitious plan led by SpaceX CEO Elon Musk. Musk envisions a self-sustaining city on Mars that could accommodate up to 1 million people, thereby transforming humanity into a multi-planet species. His vision includes regular people, not just scientists and researchers, living and working in various sectors from iron foundries to pizzerias. Nuwa City, designed by the architecture studio Ababu, is planned to be built into a cliff face on Mars. The vertical city would include homes, offices, and green spaces. The design of the city ensures scalability and reduces complexity, costs, and construction schedules. It would be powered by solar energy and would grow its own food. However, the landscape of Mars presents significant challenges, including dust collecting on solar panels and tiny Mars rocks that have caused problems with NASA's Curiosity mission. Despite these challenges, Musk is optimistic about the project and aims to make life on Mars a reality by 2029. The construction of Nuwa is due to start in 2050. The Al Janoub Stadium in Doha, Qatar, designed by the late British Iraqi architect Zaha Hadid, was officially inaugurated on May 16, 2019. It was the first new stadium commissioned for the future FIFA World Cup. The stadium is built into the city of Al Wakra, a coastal city 23 kilometers south of Doha, and has a unique and innovative design. For the World Cup, the stadium has a seating capacity of 40,000, which can be reduced to 20,000 seats in its legacy mode after the tournament. The temporary seats are designed to be demountable and transportable to a developing country in need of sporting infrastructure for post-tournament usage. The stadium also features an operable roof designed by Schlake Burgerman Partner and a seating bowl cooling system, allowing football to be played all year round. The operable roof operates like a sail to cover the oculus above the field of play and create a sheltered environment for football during the summer. The Al Janoub Stadium is not just a sports venue, but also a tribute to Zaha Hadid's innovative architectural design.
The Zhuhai Jinwan Civic Art Center, situated in the Guangdong province of China, is a new cultural center that was unveiled in February 2021 and completed in 2023. The center was designed by Zaha Hadid Architects and is located in the heart of Aviation New City, an urbanization with a built area of 4.78 million square m housing 100,000 residents. Designed as a hub of contemporary creativity within one of the world's most dynamic regions, the total area of the project is 100,000 square meters. The Zhuhai Airport Railway, an extension of the Guangzhou Zhuhai Intercity Railway, provides direct connections with Zhuhai City Center and its airport. Additionally, the new Hong Kong Zhuhai Macau Bridge enables those in Shenzhen and Hong Kong to reach Zhuhai in less than an hour. The Zhuhai Jinwan Civic Art Center is not just a place for education and entertainment, but also a monument to the shapes, movement, and geometry of the universe. It stands as a testament to the innovative architectural design of Zaha Hadid Architects. Shirku Metaverse is a decentralized virtual world that ushers in a new era of collaboration and communication. Founded in Neuchâtel and designed on the Swiss blockchain Definity, the Metaverse aims to bring major brands, particularly in the luxury sector, into the Web3 adventure. In Shirku, users can embark on an avatar journey with a universe of choices at their fingertips. They can dive into a realm of personalization, selecting from a curated array of preset libraries. With minor adjustments to facial features and hairstyles, users' digital representation begins to take shape. Users can also upload an image of their choosing and witness the transformation into a dynamic 3D model. The Chengdu Science Fiction Museum is a cultural landmark located in Chengdu Science and Innovation New City. Designed by Zaha Hadid Architects and completed in 2023, the museum covers an area of 59,000 square meters and is situated on Jingrong Lake, integrating with the natural landscapes along the lakeshore. The museum's design defines nodes of activity connected by pedestrian routes that extend from the city and adjacent metro station through the surrounding parkland into the heart of the building. This creates a journey of discovery that weaves between indoor and outdoor plazas at multiple levels to link the museum's exhibition galleries, educational facilities, cafes, and other amenities. Chengdu has launched the careers of many renowned Chinese authors over the past five decades and is the country's leading incubator of science fiction writing. The museum showcases the city's contribution to the genre's evolution and global popularity. Saudi Arabia has unveiled the design for a giant cube-shaped super-tall skyscraper, the Mucab, which will serve as the centerpiece of the new Muraba district in downtown Riyadh. The Mucab aims to become the largest built structure in the world, measuring 400 meters in height, width, and length. The building will be situated in the northwest of Riyadh, in a 19 square kilometers area that will become one of the largest downtown developments in the world. The project is set to be completed by 2030, according to the official statement of the Saudi Arabian government. Besides the MUCAB, Saudi Arabia has announced several other ambitious projects developed through their public investment fund as part of Saudi Arabia's Vision 2030 to diversify its economy and reduce its reliance on oil. The new Moraba district will feature green areas and walking and cycling paths to create sustainable transportation alternatives for the local communities. The neighborhood will feature its own internal transportation system and is designed to offer living, working, and entertainment facilities within a 15-minute walking radius. Quad Studio emerged as the winner of the Chengdu NBD Center International Competition, one of the most iconic architectural competitions in Chengdu. The competition was for a mixed-use development proposal that stands 120 meters high and features twin office towers, retail, and cultural facilities clustered around a multi-level public realm. 
The Chengdu NBD Center is located within the Jiaozi Park Business District and is envisioned as an urban fulcrum and destination to enjoy a sizable green respite in the congested city. The design of the center was a collaboration between Quad Studio and Dallo Architecture. The design was chosen from a list of international architectural firms including Lab, Stefano Buri Architetti, Arup, and Edis. The NBD Center is divided into three distinctive sections, below ground, podium, and main towers, all interconnected by pockets of public realm. The Shanghai Astronomy Museum, which opened in 2021, is situated in Lingang New City, Pudong New Area District, Shanghai. It's recognized as the world's largest planetarium in terms of building scale, spanning an impressive 38,000 square meters. The museum was designed by Eniad Architects, a firm based in New York City. The design of the museum is inspired by the three-body problem in physics, a concept that reflects the complex choreographies created by the gravitational attraction of multiple bodies within solar systems. The museum itself measures 420,000 square feet, approximately 40,000 SQM, and includes a variety of exhibits, both temporary and permanent, as well as several smaller surrounding buildings.